Saya cakap ini. Yes. 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 Okay. Make sure clear tak? Clear. Clear. Okay. Dan. 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 Yeah. Okay. So welcome back on the second part of the song Garam. Okay. In the earlier video, I have discussed. How to differentiate between soluble salt and also insoluble salt? Okay, good. Now I'm going to teach you how to prepare soluble salt. Basically, for information, now what soluble salt garam larut ada empat cara. Empat cara. Kalau nak buat garam tak larut, kita panggil penguraian ganda dua, double decomposition. Which is I'm going to cover it in a later topic. Okay, so for today we're going to focus garam larut. Ingat lagi tak? In the last chapter we have learned about acid base. What is acid plus base? Acid tambah alkali. You get what? You dapat kita dapat garam dan air. Oh, itu adalah satu cara untuk buat garam larut. Jadi, what I'm trying to say, what I'm trying to say, kalau kamu nak buat garam larut, kalau kamu nak buat garam larut, you must use acid. Kalau kamu nak buat garam larut, you must use acid. Without the acid, you cannot make soluble salt. Yang paling senang, now I'm going to do, yang paling senang adalah, yes, we have uh, acid. Plus with alkaline, alkaline. Of course, kita dah belajar salt and also water. Acid tambah alkali dapat garam dan air. Bagi saya satu contoh acid yang kamu tahu. Hydrochloric acid. Very good, very good. Hydrochloric acid. Dengar eh, this process juga dikenali sebagai apa? Acid tambah alkali dipanggil sebagai apa? Neutralization Penutralan Penutralan Therefore, the only acid that you might know HCl Where, yes, you have a plenty of different acid H2SO4 And also H3PO4 And different uh, ethanoic acid and so on But we take the simple one We take a simple one first We look how the reaction is going to done kita ada acid yang paling senang, hydrochloric acid. Bagi saya satu alkali yang senang. Okay, very good. NaOH. The nas ni, tengok sini. Maka, ini boleh pecah dari H+, Cl-, Na+, OH-. Betul? As usual practice, as a usual practice, apa yang kita buat? So, positive with negative, and the negative with positive. Gabung, kawin. He made it together. So what do you get? NaCl plus H2O. Yeah. Do you get NaCl? NaCl is a soluble salt and insoluble salt. Therefore, you manage to do a soluble salt. Ini adalah cara pertama untuk buat soluble salt. Cara pertama nak buat soluble salt. We have a different type, eh? Yang kedua, listen, what is the main ingredient untuk buat garam? Garam larut? Acid. Mesti kena ada acid. Without the acid, the reaction will never ever take place. Then, what happened? You look at here, okay? Nampak, ini. Okay. okay. Uh, acid, this time, we plus with what? We plus with metal. Acid plus with metal, then you will get salt and hydrogen gas. Ini cara kedua buat garam. Ini cara kedua buat garam. How to do it? Acid kan? Acid, simple acid, HCl plus simple metal yang janganlah terlalu tak reaktif. Okay? Ambillah yang suam-suam sikit. Let's say we have a simple one eh. Na. Then you get NaCl plus H2. But, of course, you need to balance this. Ni tak balance lagi, eh? Two kan? Then you put a two over here. Then you will notice. How to make it balance? Two chlorine. Am I right? Is this balance? Two sodium and two. Balance. Ini adalah cara kedua buat garam. 
So try to do the work. Put SC plus metal give you what? Salt and hydrogen gas. Try to put that one. SC plus alkaline give you what? Salt and water. Try to get it. We have the third one. Almost similar. Almost similar. Must you do that You must use the SC. Plus with, but this time metal oxide. Metal oxide. Then you're going to have what? Salt and water again. Any formula here? So simple met acid. Simple acid. HCl plus as metal oxide. Oxide here stand for it have oxy. Oxygen, eh? Oxygen. Therefore, for me, eh? Na2O. Senam. Senam. Then you get, and as usual, Na plus H H plus Cl minus Na plus O2 minus. Married together, married together. Then you get Na Cl Na Cl plus H two O balance not check put a two over here balance not check put a two over here then it is balance. Faham? Jadi apakah cara ketiga untuk bergerak? Soluble salt, soluble salt, acid plus metal oxide give you salt and water. The last. The last one will going to be acid plus with metal metal carbonate. When I say metal carbonate, what do you understand with metal carbonate? Apa yang kamu faham dengan metal carbonate? Metal carbonate adalah CO3 two minus. Semua benda yang ada CO3 two minus adalah metal carbonate. Jadi, tengok sini. I give a very simple one. I give a very simple H plus. Eh, sorry, sorry. Simple equation, eh? HCl plus maybe sodium carbonate and give you. Oh, sorry, I'm not sure about this part. This plus this. Dia akan bagi salt tambah dengan H2O plus with CO2. Therefore, you have this again. You break it. You break this to H plus Cl minus Na plus CO3 two minus. Gabungkan. Tapi before that, ini boleh pecah lagi. Ini kan boleh pecah lagi. It is not stable. We can further break it. So it become CO2 O2 minus. Then, ni ada tak kawan? Ini ada tak kawan? No, right? Therefore, you just leave it at behind, and of course, you make it balance, huh? Of course, you make it balance. So, this is the way to do the salt. Okay, dengar sini. Okay, ada berapa cara nak buat soluble salt? Tell me. Four. Yang first, acid plus alkaline. Yang kedua. Acid plus metal, sorry ya. Acid plus alkaline dapat apa? Salt and water. Okay, next one. Acid plus metal. What do you get? Salt and hydrogen gas. Very good. The third way of doing the salt will be acid plus metal oxide. Then you get salt and water. Now the last will be acid plus metal carbonate. Then you get salt, water. Carbon dioxide. Please memorize this. Okay, thank you. Okay, yeah. Ada soalan tak? Okay, saya ingin stop ini. Dah. Dah stop kru lo? Hah? Stop, tak ada stop. Ada stop.